Damn, you got a big wing yeah, spread. I'm a big wing. I'm a big bird. <laughs> Y'all know what it is, man. It's the Early Bird Boys, and we're here with another episode with some more Early Birds. Oh, oh. We're gonna jump right into this. What we have here is the Ama Manier Jordan Retro 2. A lot of people like this shoe. One thing I will say is they're they're kind of riding this certain way where they're kind of keeping a lot of the stuff similar. I do like with the quilted inner. The quilted's nice. They started off with the three, followed it up with the burgundy on the one, and here we are with the two. Definitely a little bit more padded this time than the first uh, three it's and all, the one. And this one. one's black, right? The this other one's black. The other ones were, the three was light gray, okay. the Jordan one was burgundy, and then this now one was black. black. Okay. They went ahead and kept the same cracked paint that you saw in the Jordan one as well. I'm a big fan of this cracked paint. I feel like it reminds me of the, was it the Dave Whites? Or was it the Lances? You know the Lance Mountains? The ones was it the they, Lance Mountains? The ones Dave they, Whites were the black splattered paint one yes, on the toe. Yes, I'm yes. talking about the Lance Mountains. The white or and black. They yeah, do the, the white pair and a black where pair. Where they rub off into the red and the blue. Yep. Um, I'm in your stitching tag on the insole, cracked leather all the way around. They went ahead and did what looks like a snake skin. Yeah, that's the main thing. On the sole. On I'm not a big fan of the snake skin. To me personally, I would have just done just some sort of tonal color and left it alone. I will say this shoe feels like a brick. It Definitely I, heavy. I think it has to do with this because this kind of sticks out way more than a regular Jordan 2. So I feel it's like it's got like that, a bigger lip on it. Yeah, I feel like that's what added the weight. So you don't think this was painted or wrapped on or anything? I don't like that? know. I can't tell. It's it's like much bigger than a regular Jordan 2, bro. I'm Definitely heavier. The colors I think they chose for these are actually really nice. Burgundy with the uh, white and I guess what color would you call that? Like a This is like a smoke. So it's clear over white. So yeah. it's definitely gonna be like a smoke color to it. Monier hit on the back, what's your say? Same thing. Monier and what's your pulley? Yeah. Um, That's like a real keychain. And and it's got this like cream colored. I do little chain I do to like it. the cream color little chain. So. Yeah, I'm on Monier. On there, cream chain, Amon Manier on the front, Amon Manier in the back. You have their classic Amon Manier Bordeaux color that they use on all of their, you know, shoes. This is a dope pair to me. So I do think it's really cool how they did like the cutout on the tongue and then inserted the, the boss, embossed logo mm -hmm. in the tongue. Mm -hmm. I think that's really cool. Is your say the same thing? Yeah, it's the same. Very so cool. there's not really a whole lot of detail. They kind of just took what they took from the one yeah. and then put it into the two. I'll tell you what's missing on this pair that we haven't found yet. Each one of the three and the one had the little hidden message. Yeah, the little script. You had the one on the back of the three. You yeah, had the other one was on the, the inside on the, on the thing. But I don't have one of those. Where is it? All right. Well, or maybe we just don't know where it is. Now I'm going to town. Oh, wait, hold on. What's that say? Insole. Oh, look. Work harder on the strings, on the tips. That's super dope. Your says work harder as well? Yeah, same thing. But it's still not a message like the other ones. I was thinking maybe it would have been like inside this yeah. clear, but it's not. it's not. Should we pull the insole out? Yeah. Tight. Pull out of nothing. <laughs> so like I said, it's basically the same version of the one converted into a two. I do like this keychain. Yeah. It's actually really, really heavy and durable. It's got some good quality to it. Nike's going hard with the twos, right? It's Nike's the year of the two, so we're getting Nike's going hard with the twos. Right it's all we're reviewing is twos. We're reviewing. <laughs> so that's that one, Amon Manier. Is this a cop for you? I'll tell you this, pictures don't do it justice. It's much better in person. This is not like I gotta have it, but I'll cop it just cause I'm trying, well, if I don't get this, I don't complete the set. I do have both too. You know what I mean? So we it would be cool. Set. Definitely a cool shoe. I think it'll do well in the store. Everything Amon Manier drops yeah. typically does well. For those of you that don't know anything about Amon Manier, it's owned by a guy named James Whitner who also owns Social Status. He has several locations all over the South and some here in Texas, in yeah. Houston. Alma Minier was a store that he opened up aside from Social Status, which is a streetwear store where things were just a little bit more higher in. Some of the brands are more selective and curated a little bit more higher, but both of those are very successful. Also, uh, the APB store as well. Yeah, and the reason why- I, I don't really know a lot about this. The store. reason why I know it is because whenever we're botting, um, APB store, Social Status, and Alma Minier- All go live at the same time. They go live at the same time. They load their products at the same time. Um, same way, that's why so I knew you APB. see the back end you yeah. all at the same? That's why I knew it. Tight. It was super cool shoe, man. I like it. Nice. All right, let's keep going. And we got one more banger. My favorite guy. Six, 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 Quality is really, really good. Like they use some nice tumble leather. This is actually, so I was arguing with Ian, I told him they reminded me of the 
premium Air Forces that came out last year for, I think they retailed for $110. Like the gold tag, they had the gold with tag. With the gold tag, and we argued and argued, he went home, took the shoe with him, compared it to the other one, and he said, in fact, that the leather on these are actually way more nice. Yep. He feels as if they're almost real leather, yeah. which now that I'm squeezing down here, Damn and I'm, I'm feeling it. Also, the inner lining and these are actually yeah. leather as well, and the premiums that they sold Smell last year it. are not. Smell it. That's leather, it. It smells, bro. It smells That's like leather, real leather. Sure. So, premium leather all the way around. What looks almost like a softer, fine leather, because this is pebbled or crushed, however you, pebbled, want to, however you want to word it. This is pebbled for sure. And then on the inside, feels almost like a lambskin leather. Yeah. It's real soft and smooth. Super and if you look on the insole, you have the Nocta Nike logo as well. There's a bunch of little baby details to this, because yeah. just from looking at it, you're like, oh cool, like, Drake dropped a white Air yeah. Force, yeah. which he's known for wearing a lot of white Air Force. He, like, he, he wears that's white Air thing. Force, that's yeah. his thing. But if you actually really tap into it, you'll notice that instead of stars, you actually have little hearts, and as well on the back, what's the back of your heel say? Got the Nocta sign, so you, you have, have the three Nike Nocta. and the Nocta. Tico and I were talking about this. I wish he would have done like Air Drake or something on the I tag. mean, his plane says Air Drake, so why wouldn't they do that? I love thing. that they even use the same leather on yeah. here, and I love that they whited out the tag as yeah, well. Yeah. Everything yeah. is just all iced out white. And then the best part about it is on the back outside heel, yeah. it says, love you. Forever. Yep. And I know there was like rumors of this dropping. They had like the little owl right here yeah. and all sorts of other stuff. Um, even like certified lover boy on the bottom, but that's not what it is. It's love you forever. Is there anything else we need to look for? Uh, I don't think so. That's it, man. The real question is, is it this shoe or the Nocta? I mean, me, I'm going Air Force. Me, I'm You're going, going Nocta. I'm going or with the, the Terra. The Terra. Yeah. So I want to go downstairs, pull the other one out, and I want to just talk to either employees or customers coming in and see which one, if they could get it, which one they would choose. I feel like this one's going to get chosen more. The Terra's a new shoe, so no one even knows what it feels like to wear, what it looks like to wear. You know what this looks and feels like. You everybody, put it on, you know it goes with everything. Everybody, Pants, everybody knows what Gator Forces are. Is this like no. Gator Scan Forces? <laughs> And then I also want to pull this, the three, and the one out and see which one that they would rock with. That's easy though. The three. Easy. Though. All day. Yeah. I love that yeah, shit. Yeah, that three. I love that little purple they did down at the bottom. Yeah. Anyways, I want to I do both. Okay. So we'll do this one cool. first and then I'll pull the other three out and we'll ask them about those three as well. Cool. So we're out. Let's go downstairs. Okay. What I want to know is your pick and why. Right here we have both the Drake's new Nocta shoes that he's dropped with. Nike. You have the classic Air Force One, and then you have a new silhouette, the Terra, that no one's seen before. Stand. What I want to know is, which out of the two, Izzy, would you choose, and why? This one. Okay, why is that? A little like an alien shoe. It's Looks different. Like alien shoe? It's different. Like cool new silhouette to you? Yeah. This is the one. What about you, Jordan? Um, I'm going Force all day. Okay, all day. okay. It's like well, not even... It's a, not even a question, right? Not even a question. The quality is really nice on this. Is that because you know how they look on you? That's no. my concern is everyone's gonna go with this because they know shorts, sweats, pants, they know how to wear it. You probably never worn this shoe before because it's brand new. You don't know. You I might would like not it. wear this shoe because I don't like this shoe. You don't shoe like this shoe? Mm, really? No. Like, I'm gonna I don't tell you, I've, second guess. I've worn both and I'm going this way. My honest thing is, like, I was talking to a customer yesterday. Oh, lame if y'all if, no, if, if, if Drake's name was not attached to this shoe and it was just sitting in here, this would never be touched. Steve but what do we say? If this didn't have Drake's name and it was a regular regular Nike silhouette, we'd still mess with it. For sure, for sure. You know why? This, it reminds me of a 700, the Yeezy 700. That's what he said. Yeah. That's, that's why I like it. That's why it's I like this. Chunky, it's like it's for chunky sure. dad, dad shoe type. I'm not, it reminds me of that Birdman joint. What is now, it? The Lukies? They're so called the Lugs. <laughs> oh, my bad. <laughs> um, it was before his time, first of all. I chose this one because I know how these wear and tear. Yeah. And an Air Force never lasts long for you, me. You ain't never had this premium leather on your Air Force though. So I feel like these are a different look and I feel like they're just gonna be more of a better wear. I grab the forces for my girl. And, okay, is. so so you're going you're going hot step, you're going hot step, you're going forces. Force. I'm a surgeon. Going going force. I'm going for it. What about heaves? Heaves. Heaves. Which one are you going? Between? Bro, you go force you going? Drake force or Drake hot step? All oh, day. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Hey, valid. Valid. Yeah, yeah, these are shit, bro. These are shit. All right, now why, now, now, why, though? Though? now why would you choose that one? Uh, because these can be mistaken 
as like if I'm walking around. Mm. Like, okay, that's, that's, that's a regular. That's a good idea. I like that's these because yeah. from far away, you know what I'm wearing. You say it's a statement. It's a statement. Ah, bro. Okay. Think about that. That's yeah, what that's I like smart. about these. I like that. I mean, come Chino? on. Chino? If you had to choose between the two, which and why? First off, he's a Drake oh. hater. Oh no, actually, if y'all guys didn't know, Drake was one of my musical inspirations growing up. So Yeah, until you became a Drake hater. <laughs> <laughs> Anyhow, we're going to squash that beef right here. Air Force is just because this is easier to wear. Um, somebody told me that that was very discomforting on me, camera. I told you that. Yep. Yeah. So just my because toe. of comfortability. It's, it's because, like, you see how narrow that toe gets? Yeah. Imagine taking all your toes and just neat all day. That don't make sense. I wouldn't want to wear that all day. I feel like you can just wear Air Forces all day. And be fine with that. Yeah, so, so it's four three right now. Yeah, it's four three. Uh, what, so are, we, uh, are we winning? Are we winning? To, we're uh, winning still. So. We're winning. I mean, yeah. if you had to choose between the two, which one and why? This, I mean, you know this better. This is the no tiebreaker. Tie oh, this is the tiebreaker. Tie oh, it's either uh, no, it's, it's either a dub or tie. And go with the. Uh, okay, now why? Um, it's a different shoe. This looks exactly like an Air Force, so I couldn't get myself to pay. The premium for just love you forever and okay. a little on. hit on the back. I like their Let me bring my hands though. Certified lover boys, bro. You, have you, have to, you gotta be a lover boy. You, you gotta be a lover boy. You have to admit what they're saying. They're pretty good. I agree. Pretty good. I agree. What are you talking about? We'll see the same I'm, person. I didn't even think about that. Shoes. I mean, I'm biased because I already got about? these. So I'm, if I got these, I'd have both. I know you said that you couldn't tell the difference, right? But as soon as I walked in the store today, Tico had a regular Air Force in this one. And from the distance, he's like, can you tell the difference? And I knew in me, I could see you the leather. You can see that leather, bro. Like, oh. This is not. They don't make bro. Air Forces with right, this leather there's anymore. There's nothing that's standing out to let you right know here, that right that's, that's it. Oh, it's standing out on the back. Check, check, it. check my back tabs. All right, so right now we're 5'3". Well, Jacob, which one and why? Well, I mean, I already knew which one I was going to choose the second this came out. I like this one better. Okay. And Is there a reason not, behind it? Design, I guess. I can't do Air Forces. I don't care about comfortability. Like I just guys said, I like being it narrow. Right. Yeah. I just like design. The design on that one just is cooler. That, that's enough for me. Yeah. It, like Five, I said, this one is just six, like... 6'3". I mean, it's over, dude. It's 6'3". Last one, Caleb. I need to know. Caleb's, Caleb's matters. I feel like he already knows like what Caleb's, it is and why. Caleb's on my team. I know you're feeling what which right. one and why? My opinion, if you're saying this, you're lying. You're, you're yeah. lying to yourself. You're lying to yourself because <laughs> that's nasty. Yeah. This kid is underage. His his opinion doesn't I'm matter. I'm 18. <laughs> his, his opinion doesn't matter. I'm him out of the way. Get him out of here. Now why though? Because I feel like the attention to detail in this shoe is so nice. They can't even manufacture this shoe because of this. Guess what? Can I tell you something? When this shoe's all the way down here, 254. Bro, I see that quality. You do not see no. those parts. Okay, see that quality. when this shoe is all the way down here, it looks like a K-Swiss. Ooh. That's what I already said that episode. I know. So I already know it's got the silhouette of a, of a lug, a I don't even know why I'm like trying to fight for this because I, lo I love the shoe too. Yeah, exactly. I love that shoe. You're a cheerleader, bro. I love that shoe. One time, this is my team. I'm just holding the team down. Well, they're both your team, technically. I know, I know. Right, let's ask the customer though real quick. All right, we got a question for you. If you had to choose which one, which one would it be and why? I go with the forces. I just think they look cleaner. Uh, the signature on the side, super dope. I was excited to see these. Um, I don't know, bro. These just reminded me of a shoe you can't break in. Like, I, if I tried these on, it's like it has to be the shorts. Like you the said, they're really uncomfortable. Yeah, it's like that toe box. Yeah. That toe box squeezes your toe together a little bit. It is very narrow, right here. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie. K-Swiss, Fila type. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly what we were saying too. Oh, okay. Lug, K-Swiss. That one looks dope, though. This is cool too. If you see, look at the toe. You see how they normally have stars? Oh yeah. They yeah, switch them for hearts. Super dope. Yeah. yeah. No, like now, those. with that being said, put this up next to it. Yeah. It's really just kind of comparison to the two in the leather. Yeah. But like, definitely that's a whole different it's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a different Super shoe. Thing. That's a whole different ball game leather quality. Yeah. yeah. I think the only thing that's the same, well no, that's a shiny finish and that's a yeah. Just like a regular mat. Yeah. Insole looks nice. Insole's yeah. cool. Yeah, yeah, I like those little cool. 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 cool man. Appreciate, appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Can I ask you a question, man? Good. All right, come over here real quick. Both Drake, both Nocta. If you had to choose one, which one and why? I mean, it's a no-brainer to go with those because, I mean, not only are they already an AF1 background, but I ain't never seen no joints with, like, leather. Yeah, that leather's nice, right? Crazy. I mean, these, these are hard. I would cop these just because, like, they Drake shoe, mm -hmm. but, like, I wouldn't wear these on a regular day, like, to be honest with you. Before so you, you wear everything. Keep this OG then, yeah, right? You can wear that with anything. Yeah, leather on that side, leather nice, and bro. You see? <laughs> you see? So the reason why this might not come out, you see how they all 
uh, Nikes usually have the stars. Yeah. They did hearts for like certified lover boy instead of that. And that's what they're saying. It's too hard to manufacture the sole. Uh, so they may just scrap the shoe all together. Yeah, that looks, that looks pretty yeah, good. Yeah, but. Okay, okay, so you're down by one after asking the, the, <laughs> the customers. Yeah, you're down by one now. So it's like seven, six. You might be either the tiebreaker Okay. Or you might or give you the might, W, it might be the, the W. Shoe. If you had to pick one, which one would it be? And why? And why? Air Forces. Okay, so you picked the Air Force. Now, why would you choose the Air Force? Well, like, they're more like the silhouette. I feel like people will wear it more. It's easier to rock with, like, faster. Yeah. See, that was my problem, is I feel like everyone goes towards this one because they know how it fits, knows how to, know how to rock it. This one, you're gonna have to figure out, like, okay, can I wear this with yeah. baggy pants? Can I wear this with shorts? Yeah. And so you, got, that, you gotta that relearn my, that one. You gotta relearn, you gotta learn this one in general. All right, well, you just tie breaked everything, so you just now made it more difficult. I need to find one more person. We need one, one more, more person. Oh, we got one more? Here's All the right. breaker right here. This is the breaker. Okay. Okay. If you had to choose one shoe, which one and why? The inside of this is crazy. I ain't gonna lie. This now I'm talking, if this is right in front of you, I'm like, pick one, you can have it. Jeez. I'm gonna lie. Forces all day, bro. Forces all day. You heard it. There it is. Eight to seven. So, so it's just employees that really want the dot step. The regular general consensus customers want the Air Force. I don't These are better, bro. Way better. Maybe I'm just biased right now because it's unreleased versus released. You just can't excite me with anything that's all white but right the, now. But it's like the point of it. It's like it's just clean. But it didn't excite me. You're talking about that excited you? Yeah. Because it's different. It's new. I like new. I feel that. This is a remix of a classic, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Y'all ready for round two? Yes. Round two. Here we have the Amma Meniers. You have the one, two, three. Three drop first, then the one, then the two. Two's actually not even out yet. Izzy. Which one and why? Now why? I like the color. I like the color grannies. I feel like I feel like majority of these colors here are pretty much neutral. You're a neutral I feel like guy. You wear all tans. And I feel like I'm a creamy guy. Yeah, he's, he's creamy. Yeah. I mean neutral. I'm a very neutral If you don't guy. know, what do they call me? Creamy. creamy. Damn. Oh, shit. <laughs> You're good, bro. That was <laughs> Damn. It's not your fault. It's Steve's fault. Damn it, Steve. Yo, y'all should have saw how quick I was about to duck. I thought somebody was popping shots. Fuck, man. My bad. Right, it's time to clean up. We got to do a clean up time. Party foul by Steve-O. Why'd you do that, Steve-O? Yo, chill. <laughs> He threw it at me. We have to ask him. Yeah, ask him. Go for it. Oh, yeah. yeah, no, these are not. No, 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 no. Which would you rather do if you have to pick? Would you do these or the first? I don't know. I'm a, for I'm a forces kind of guy. I'm not really big on like the, the knock the silhouette. Ain't it. Can I tell you something, bro? I love Drake though. Here, Drake's here. Drake. Check this first. I mean, quality. He he better be coming with the quality. These are cool. I like the little Nike. Sh I like I like the artistry of that. This is not. All right. So which one are you going with? Just look at that. It's like a fucking. So you doing those? Triangle you doing with those? No, I'm fucking with the forces. I'm from Chicago. You're basic. You're basic. I'm from Chicago. Let's go. You're basic. Let's go. Forces. Forces. G Fazos. So. Yes. Yes. All white G Fazos. He's basic. Come on now. You know I'm not basic. Hey, he's basic. You know I'm not basic. But it's yeah. all good. I need to know. One, two, or three, and why? These because Jordan ones are just my thing. They look good on my body, so I just. These look better in my opinion. Okay, that's a good. You you wear ones a lot. Yes, I wear ones all the time, and like the threes are close second, but I like that there's more color on this shoe. So now rank them, first, second, third, real quick. I just want to know this. Uh, first, second, third. Yeah. I'm gonna have to go with the threes. Nice. I had a feeling this was gonna be shoe of the year last year, and I had I had to call these. Okay. For okay. my collection. And then if you had to go with next the next, what would it be? It's gotta be the one. Y'all know I'm a, I'm a one guy, yeah, but yeah, I feel like they botched the attempt with this one. I feel like this shoe could look a little better than it did. But. Here's what I'm thinking. Scott. I think the quality on the snake skin is trash. This is what's throwing me off. It's like this is where they messed up. The colorways are amazing with the snake. They should have they should have done Bro. this with with this kind of leather. Yep. Should have been on it, and then like different panels using this cracked thing that they got going on. If they would have paneled it, the one probably would have been my, my choice. I just think this colorway is so much no, better with is, the gray, bro. this, that. If they would have thrown some white on the on the upper, for sure. Yeah. And not much of a two guy. These are all right. I do like the material, but yeah. these would be my last pick, for sure. 
Thanks, man. I appreciate it. And I totally you. agree with you. Peeps. What's up, guys? Came in Nike down, bro, with the black yeah. hat. Oh, Nike, you the shirt. Oh, you in the shirt, Nike, too? In the shirt, bro. Dang, show me the shirt. And the ring. Nike ring? Oh, got the Nike ring on? Yeah. All right. Details. Yes, sir. All right, which so one do I like which one is your favorite? Why? And then rank them in order one through three. Okay. I like the threes. Yes, everyone likes these. Everyone does. But it, it, there's a reason for it. It's the best shoe, bro. Why? You know? It's just the colorway. It's neutral. Super easy to wear. Okay. Anyways, the first one. First. Second. Third. Which one's your favorite and why? And then rank them one through three. Favorite, all time favorite is gonna just be the three. Boom, why? Uh, just because one, I think the attention to details on this one was incredible. Um, I do realize, I mean, I don't know how far I can go into it, but I love how they put on the heel tab right here, the quilt by yep, his mother. I love, that. Um, I love the quilt inside. I love the colorway too, just simply white and gray. It's very neutral tone, so you can match with anything. And they also, they go with that vintage sole right there. So obviously All I about that. the vintage sole, baby. And they gave you cream laces on them. So. All about it. Yeah, I think this was just well done. I just love it. I love the pebbled leather right here. And then now, in order. Order? One, two, three. Yeah. One, two, three. Yeah. Yeah. Typically everybody's, or yeah. this one, that one, that one. Thank you, sir. So far, the two's last on yeah. the last people we've asked. Uh, maybe lies. over time, maybe some people might grow into it, but I think two's people are just having to oh, get settled into it right now. Yeah. Then they're not used to the twos, they're just used to ones and threes. So we'll I like your right. pants. Appreciate it. Yeah, look clean. So, I like, I like the You know who's next, Scott? Izzy. Izzy! <laughs> bro, he's looking. Bro, people don't know you, bro. I'm an artist. Everybody know me. <sighs> All right. Ask the cream bandit real quick. I'm that creamy guy, bro. Which one's your favorite and why? And then rank them one through three. That one. Why? It's because I have a lot of clothes that go with this. I like how neutral it is. The colors, even the gray, like the console, the gray, even when they have this, like this, what is this, purplish, uh -huh. burgundy? Yeah, it's like a little, like a like matte purple. Mauve. I'm just really into colors, but like these colors here really goes well with like anything I wear. Okay. Like even our new private selection shirt, you guys should check those out. You see I how mean, well you that really clothes look? Down, you can, you definitely can, you can do, do anything. You right? can do any of those. Here, look. It, look, has you know, like, it has all the little creams and little. Somewhat. I do well, think I, I like this most of it. Yes, exactly. That's why I picked the threes. Okay. Tell them where to get that shirt. PRVT so dot selection. No. Oh, yes. Check out our network, my guy. What? No. <laughs> PRVT dot selection. Yeah. So go to, don't go to PRVT.selection, go to PRVTSelection.com, please, because that's oh. our website. He clearly does, and this is not a joke. He literally doesn't know our website. I don't know where Dot Selection came from. I don't know either. I'm trying to figure it out right now. Oh, I, I know where it came from. It's our IG. It's PRVT.selection on IG. See, there you go, guys. I, I, know, the, I know the website. That's not the website, it's the Instagram. Bro, name them one, two, three. Okay, but so first, I will pick these. You're not feeling that? Nah, I, I think the twos are kind of cool. It is cool, right? I like Jordan ones too. First, second, third. All right. Thank you for your time, sir. Wait, wait. What did everybody else do? The exact same thing you did. Something wrong with him, bro. And Jaime, you're up next. <laughs> Come on down. All right, Jaime. One, two, or three. Why? And then rank them in one, two, three order. Okay. For me, this is my favorite out of all of them. I also have the three, but I rock these with the cream laces, and the cream laces look really sets good. It yeah, yeah, it sets it off. Does it set the off. sole off better? Yeah, it looks really good on nice. feet. These, I actually like thought that it was like, I wouldn't say I was hating on it, but I didn't think it was shoe of the year. I think everybody overhyped it to be shoe of the year. I personally put other shoes on top of it. I did see those rankings and everyone kept having yeah. that one at the top. And and I, I'll agree one. with you. I don't think it was shoe of the year, but it's a good shoe. It's a though. good shoe, but I think everybody hopped on the train of like shoe of the year, shoe of the year. And what's crazy is they hopped on it late because yeah. this shoe came out and then yeah. had no resale. No resale. No resale. I caught mine for 400 bucks and now, and now like it's like eight, eight. 900 yeah. So I'd go one, second, third. And what's if weird is that the resale wasn't high, but the weird thing is, is like they only dropped it on Alma Manier and then a month later went back and then dropped it again on Alma Manier and yeah. sneakers, yeah. remember? And sneakers, yeah. So you would exactly. think it would go up when it only dropped in one yeah. little spot, nope. but it didn't. I think these People resale wise should do good too. Like they're pretty low right they're now. Low also, they're pretty yeah. low right now. Yeah. I can see them going up. That's my opinion. Appreciate and I think it, if these come with cream laces, 
hard. Jordan, what you doing back there? Taking his fourth lunch. Yeah, what are you yeah, doing back look, there? Look, he came out with a muffin, bro. You already took a break? Bro, you need me to pick. <laughs> did, you, did, you, did you take a break or not? <laughs> you need me. You no. took a nice break. He goes, you need me to, he's still eating right now, look at him. Okay. My favorite shoe and why? Yes. I'm going with these, right? The okay. three. This is honestly, hands down, I think the best three that I've seen come out in a really long time. I don't even really wear neutral colors like this, but I love it. Super clean quality, the quilt on the inside. A1 to me. I agree. I've seen so many good fits with these. So like people come Easy in and I'm like, it, right? wow. I do like the one, right? Burgundies, I don't own any burgundy, right? So that's the only thing that X's it out for me. But same thing with the quilted on the inside. Can you wear but, it with an all black fit? So this has black in it. So are you talking this, this, that? Mm. Two is X'd out for me. Just I've, cause you don't like silhouette? I don't like the silhouette. I've never, I can't recall one person with a good two fit on. No on one's you. got them to do it. But I think that says it right there. No one has them because no one likes them. I don't think it's that. I think it's that they haven't made them. My favorite, second favorite, not even a favorite. Okay. But well, there you uh, have it. James, you're killing it, man. Keep it up. For real. We're going to close it out with this. You want to go first? Mine's the same as yours. Okay. Ours are probably identical. We both love the three. Scott and I both have both of these pairs, so we'll need this one when it comes out. We're going three for number one, just because, like we said, like the, the color scheme of this, the white, the gray, and then this kind of like off purple instead of this burgundy is way better of a colorway. We're going with the one right after, and then we're ending it with the unreleased. Now, I'm not gonna lie though, like, like I was trying, I realized with Jordan is, I could probably rock this fit easy, more easy than I could this for the simple fact that there's black in it. So black and white would be a lot easier to tie. Because if you're wearing an all black fit, this yeah, is gonna look better than this. That or you have the pants would cover the burgundy and then it just looks like you're wearing, you know, black and white or white and black. Cool guys, I wanna know in the comments which Drake in Nocta and why and which Amal Manier and why. And with that, we're out. <laughs>